A very warm welcome to the learning home. Today we are going to have another discussion. Uh, it is a tutorial in the Excel chart series. Talk about how to manage missing data in the Excel chart or how to display a missing data correctly in the Excel chart. So primarily when the data is missing, the chart looks a bit distorted. So how we can present it nicely, that's the key point of discussion today. So in order to do the exercise, here is our sample data set. And before I start the discussion, I like to bring this one to your notice that I'm using Microsoft Office 365, which is the latest version of this point of time. And if you are using different version of Microsoft Excel, you might see a different appearance, but you don't have to worry about whole core feature should be similar. So let's get started. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to select this data first and uh, go to insert in this uh, uh, tab and you can either start the graph with the recommended chart. When you click it once, it will see this is the line chart, which is perfectly fine for us. So let's click it. Okay. And you will see the chart is plotted. I can delete the previous uh, chart. So let's get it enlarged a little bit. So here you will be seeing that there are some of the data on the 5th May, 7th May, 9th May is missing. So that is the reason why you will see that some of the information here is missing as well. So this is looks a little bit ugly. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to click this line chart, chart elements and then select data. And you will see here is an option called hidden and empty cells. That's the, our area of interest. So click it once and it will see another box appeared and it says because by default it is selected as a gap is remained in this way. So let's look at another option that is called zero. How does it look like? So click it once and see click OK and click OK again and you will see the empty values are marked as zero which is in fact that's another kind of ugly representation of the data so what i'm going to do i'm going to do go back to the select data once again and select hidden and empty cells and then another option is connect data points with a line so basically it is trying to connect the previous data to the new data with a, some kind of line so click it okay and let's look at how does it look like click one more time okay and you will see there is a very nice representation of data so here you will notice that there is a point if you click it once that is for the 5 to 5 0 which is for 4th may and for 5th may there is no value because there is no value here so the connecting that option what we have selected has connected this this line this point and this point so that is all for today's discussion and hope you have find it uh, insightful. Thank you. In case you find it interesting, please do subscribe, like and share. Please also press the bell icon so that you will be notified about the future videos. And if you want me to cover a new topic, please suggest me by writing in the comment section. I will cover in the future videos. And with this, goodbye and see you soon.